Welcome back to the Chance Pitch Show, everyone. I am your host here, as always, here on YouTube, as well as twitch.tv forward slash the Chance Bishop Show Live, where we stream usually every week. But drop that channel a follow, turn notification bells on so you know when we're streaming. Usually stream some NHL content, and we also are the you know the main guy on Chance Bishop Breaks. We're opening up brand new packs every Monday and Friday at 10 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. So check it out. Links for all those are in the description down below. Uh, but hey, take on the Nashville Sound here. Still with Columbus. You gotta love it when we're just stuck behind. I think Byron Buxton's the center fielder. They, they brought him in. And they're just gonna be like, yeah, no, we have this young 20-year-old outfielder. We're gonna pay Byron Buxton a bunch of money. A bunch of money that we don't really have. I like, I like that in Road to the Show. It seems like teams just kind of fall apart super, super easily. Like, no one no one stays with their team. Players move around like crazy. Absolutely insane how often players move around. You know, I was looking at some of the rosters. You know, Dodgers don't have, like, Bellinger anymore. You know, uh, you know it, it's just insane some of the moves that get made. You know, Dodgers only have, like, Mookie Bats. I think Clay and Kershaw for the Dodgers is, like, AAA. You know, even the players that really aren't on, you know, Cleveland right now. It's weird. It's just weird how things move around. You know, I thought franchise mode moves were weird. You know, I, I forget who signed, you know, Gary Sanchez in our franchise mode, but it was just a team that didn't make really sense for Gary Sanchez to go to. Is like, I don't know, like the Cubs or something. I don't know. I just, I don't know. I, I just don't think it was the best move for him. Now, but hey, a home run here in the ninth ties the game up. Love to see that right there for a chance. Bishop. Love that game tying home run blows the save, you know, because this guy thought, hey, I'm in double A, I'm in triple A right now, I'm just gonna kill it, I'm going to get this nice easy save, but no, Bishop comes up and just ruins this poor man's day, first batter he sees too, just ruins this poor man's day, like why, why, why ruin that poor guy's day, uh, unfortunately we still do lose the game, which is uh, possibly the worst thing ever. Like, how do you, how do you come back, hit that game time camera, and still, and still lose that? That's just, that's horrible. That's awful. But taking on game two, we get a nice pop out at bat. We're gonna send that one right, clap by that right fielder. Though. That's a bit unfortunate. You know, we're just gonna clap our hands and go back to the dugout, doing our best just to, you know, do what we do best here. We're, we're keeping on. With everything that's going on now in the sixth inning, we're down by two runs. Bishop hit that game tying home run in a game we dropped yesterday. So we're going to try and uh, get some runs. No, no runs here. We don't do runs here. We're not we're not a run scoring team. I'd prefer if you take the word runs and jettison it into the sun. Because Chance Bishop, not in a run scoring mood. As we drop this game as well. Is that Daniel Vogelbach right there? He looks really, really thin for some reason. A lot thinner than he should be. I don't know. I haven't seen Daniel Vogelbach in a while. It's been a while since he was a top prospect for the Mariners. But now, second inning of game three. It's going to be a flying out. Chance to try to get to the cutoff, man. Not in time, though, as that's uh, going to be a guy at third base now. Third inning, taking that bat. We're batting in the nine hole this game, boys and girls. And that's going to result us in a fly out to the center fielder. All right, fifth inning. We can do this. We got this coming in for this one. And that's going to be a, it's gonna be an out. Ends the fifth inning right there at that catch. Sixth inning now of a tie game. That ball's chopped to the first person who t tosses it to the pitcher instead of running the 10 feet. So it's okay for him, I guess. Now, eighth inning, that's going to be a base knock. We're down by two runs, though. But hey, one out here in the eighth. We can, we can tie this game up. We can do it. We can tie the game up big right now. We don't, we don't tie the game up big at all. We did the exact opposite. We actually lost this game right here. And that resulted in us losing the playoffs here in the AAA All-Star playoffs. Yeah, not not how you want it. We did not have a good performance against, uh, I believe it's the Nashville Sound. But yeah, no, they, they beat us. They beat us, the Columbus Choppers, Cooks, something. Nashville beats Columbus in the AAA playoffs. You hate to see that right there. 
That definitely leads to some upsetting spaghettiness since last season. Championship was on the opposite side of this in the double AL postseason where he won it all. The Brewers win the World Series, it seems like, in 2022. What a weird World Series. Brewers versus Rays. Okay, then Yelich gets a ring. Now take a look at all these people right here. Bregman, Giles. Yeah, everyone, everyone here is getting some nice little awards. Good on all of these players uh, for with the win. Definitely like seeing uh, these award winners right now as they're doing uh, their absolute best to just you know have good seasons. You know, Pete Alonso, 47 bombs, beats out Bryce Hopper. Unfortunately, hate to see that. Barry had a 21 win season. That's absolutely insane. May uh, may the world never have to deal with a really good Trevor Bauer. That's actually good. That was at the worry about being said. Yo, he had a Mickey Mouse season. Because that would be probably one of the worst things for baseball. Nah, I'm joking. That'd be a great thing for baseball. Trevor Bauer being Trevor Bauer is one of the best things in baseball. He's a bright spot in baseball. There, I said it. Ho hope you don't hate that. But on text on YouTube, peace out. Rock on. This is Superclass. And you guys will catch you here next time on the Chance Pitcher Show some other day.